What is going on everybody? My name is Pete and you guys are watching Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs day number 1592 coming at you once again with another brand new video. Hope you're all doing fantastic out there ladies and gentlemen. If you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats or any of the others, you, my friends, are in the right place to stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job. Of course, leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And let's jump on into this topic Thornton Mellon, Triple Lindy, all that good stuff. Now, this was actually not an email uh, or a message. This was actually a comment that I received on a recent video. All right, get ready for this. Now, <clears throat> I have made dozens of videos about DoorDash pausing dashers, right? Okay, we're probably all sick and tired of the pausing situation. However, however, one of our viewers here may have just found a loophole in the system. This comment at the time of me screenshotting it got 17 thumbs up, okay? So listen to this. The user play by play with Lazarus said the following. I cherry picked every single day for several months. What I do is simply deny three of them then I pause myself and unpause seconds later, okay? Let me repeat that. What I do simply is deny three orders, then pause myself and unpause seconds later. It bypasses their system and you can, and, and you can continue your dash. You miss seconds, but who cares? It's a way around their so-called pausing or end of dash. Seriously, people, that is all you've got to do. <laughs> By the way, it, it didn't take me a while to figure out their loophole. It took minutes. And then Roger Eddington, another one of our viewers here, responded saying, this is great news. And let me tell you something. Whenever I can find something that's like a loophole in the system or a little shortcut or something to make dashers lives a little bit easier i want to get it out to you as fast as humanly possible this is awesome okay so play by play with lazarus you got the mvp for today so a couple of questions for all the drivers and dashers out there one are you a cherry picker how much would you say you cherry pick would you have to you have to cherry pick constantly in your market or just every now and then in my particular market on Grubhub, the cherry picking is something that does take place, but it doesn't have to be so aggressive, okay? Because in my market, people tend to be a little bit more on the generous side. They, they always have been since the beginning, since 2017. And, and, you know, and, and I'm in a busy market, I'm in a metropolitan area, but not everyone has that luxury. A lot of people are in smaller markets where it's not as busy. A lot of people are in markets where people don't pay or tip as well. So the cherry picking may be more aggressive, okay? Now, remember, how this works is an order pops up, decline. An order pops up you don't like, decline. An order pops up you don't like, decline. You pause yourself, okay? Don't let them pause you, that's the trick here. You pause yourself for a few seconds, maybe three to five seconds, you unpause and then continue and rinse and repeat. So then if you have to decline three more, you pause yourself for a few seconds and then unpause. And I can see how this bypasses their system as a loophole. So this is brilliant. So I'm gonna urge you all if, to go out there and try it, okay? This doesn't break any rules. This doesn't break any laws, okay? This is not something you can be deactivated for as far as I know because you're allowed to reject as many orders as you want, okay? So don't let DoorDash take advantage of you. Try this out, see if it works for you and report back here on the video, leave a comment, okay? So I'm curious to see how it works for all of you. So big shout out to Play by Play with Lazarus. 
Of course, if you guys ever have anything you want to share with me, a comment, a topic, a question, a story, an article, whatever you got, send me an email, paid to drive stories at gmail.com. It's the best way to reach me. Uh, information's down below. Or for a quicker response, you guys can always message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. Link is in the description down below or in the pin top comment. So definitely go and check that out, everybody. Um, anyone who signs up as a patron as my way of saying thank you is I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos, which I'm going to do right now. So when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. We have our tier five driver. We have Ron Grubb, John Birchfield, David Moore, Angela Counts McCarty, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Jimmy Santiago, Joe Valerio, Kirk Paul, Laura Love, Tulsa Todd, Agus, April Jewup, uh, Alan G. Van Horn, Nick Gilroy, Drew Hanor, Todd Rosemanith, Fernando Carranza, Frank Havilland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Tom Perry, Chadrick Howell, Brian Richardson, Candace Mitchell, Jenny Thomas, Joyce Hine, LaDonna Roten, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, Valerie Brown, Rebecca Swenson, and Melody Long. So huge shout out to every single one of you guys out there. Really, really appreciate all of you. So with that being said, everybody, uh, yeah, Patreon, go check it out. Links down below. Who's going to be the next patron? Maybe it'll be you. Let's find out. And of course, moving along, I hope every single one of you out there is saving lots of money on your gas with the free gas app called Get Upside. That link is in the description down below or in the pin top comment. Definitely go and check that out. Uh, when you click on the link, it'll tell you uh, how to install it on whatever kind of phone, tablet, or device you have. And uh, from that point, um, you go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside gas app. And within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description. Make sure to download it today, everybody. Go and check that out. And of course, for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies, you guys should know the place by now. We got you covered at paidthedrivestore.com. We have lots of brand new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day at paidthedrivestore.com. Go check out the link down below. It's the place for you. And if you made it to the end of this video, thank you very much. Leave a comment saying end 709, E-N-D 709. Just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And also, have you guys all uh, subscribed to my other channel, uh, Team PTD, where we have uh, lots more paid to drive content. Links are down below. Subscribe over there and tap that notification bell. Uh, trying to get up to 2,000 subscribers on there, of course. <clears throat> so leave a like over here. Leave a like over there. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. So leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D. And until next time, everybody, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling, keep bustling, and we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Logs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace, everybody. Later.